Good morning, everybody. How are you all doing? Welcome to another vlog. Just finishing to get ready to head for lunch with my girlfriend. I'm going to pick something from my new haul that I recently did. There are a couple of gaps missing on my wardrobe. Some of those staple everyday timeless pieces and those gaps were either pieces that I didn't have at all and so I needed to get myself one to fill that gap or they were pieces that I actually do have but I've had them for a little bit way too long and they needed replacing. And so as you might have guessed from the title of this video, today we are going to have a haul but that will be a little bit later. I'm just waiting for my curls to cool off completely so I can undo them with this little white tooth comb that I recently got. I actually got it quite a long time ago but I used it first in Greece because I had forgotten my actual brush and then I fell in love with it and yeah I've been really enjoying to use this. Also I've changed the way I do my hair. This needs to be turned off. Safety. <laughs> it's not really a new one but it's sort of a revival for me. Now this one is by Bremington. I've had it for the longest time and recently I came about it again. Um, I think I found it in a drawer. And the only thing I did to my hair before was I washed it last night. I used some Kerastase heat protectant, let it air dry while I slept, and then I curled it with this today. So I didn't even have to actually dry my hair. And I've been really liking the effect that it gives. Obviously, like I said, they are not cooled off just yet. So they're not undone. But I feel like after they just give a little bit of that nonchalant beach vibe that I really like for the summertime. I also have a giveaway for one of you. I got myself a product that I really enjoy using and I thought I might as well get two of them and I'll get one for a lucky winner of the giveaway. So these are the Elizabeth Arden Advanced Light Ceramide Capsules. They are really, really nice for toning your skin, giving a little bit of a firmer look. It helps you get a bit of a more even texture. And the way it works is, let me show you what you'll actually get. So this is for one of you. You get all of those little capsules in there and one capsule. Can you shut up? You have a bird's nest <laughs> right at the patio side. So you're gonna have to excuse me for that. And so each one of the capsules amounts for the amount of serum that you should be putting. So I really, really like this one's also for when I'm traveling and I need to be a little bit light on my traveling packing. Even if we all know I'm not really a big light packer, but still on times when I really have to, it's very nice because you can just pick how many capsules you're going to need for the days that you're going to be on holiday. That's all you have to carry. You can just chug it in a Ziploc with some other goodies inside and then you're good to go. One of you will be getting this one. All of the instructions on how to enter the giveaway will be written on the description area of the video down below. It's not really something I'm doing in partnership with Elizabeth Arden or anything like that. It's just I'm a big fan of the brand. I want to get myself something and I thought I might as well get you a little thank you for all the support that you guys have been showing lately. I wish I could get one for everyone. Maybe one day. I swear if one day I'm in the position to do so, I will. <laughs> but for the time being, there will be one lucky winner. I think it's always nice to get something like that for your girlfriends. And then talking about girlfriends, I need to get myself dressed. So I'm going to pick myself something from my little haul that I did. Get myself to lunch with the girls and then I'll see you on the way back so we can do a little bit of a try on together. Back from lunch, I had the most delicious avo toast and I think I only ended up showing you dessert, but I wanted to show you the jewelry I'm wearing today. I have quite a couple of pieces that I've added, I would say to my daily jewelry routine. And by the way, if you haven't seen the um, everyday jewelry video, I will make sure to link it up here for you. I've got this Misuma earrings. I've gone back to using my Idil chain all the way up to my ear and I really, really like the look that that gives. I've also got my Miss Blue ring that I just love how much it sparkles and I think it looks very cute on the same hand um, as my wedding band on the index finger. I've also got the Narcissus Diamonds by the Yard bracelet which just sparkles so much. I really really like this one. It matches the necklace which will be this one right here. Anyway I'm going to stop waffling and show you everything I got from Goelia so we can have a little look and a try on together. Now this first look I'm actually sharing with you is what I was wearing for lunch today. This is is a beautiful cotton jacket. It's got some navy over white stripes, little golden button details down the front, and it's also got some 
on the sleeve. To me, this is the perfect continuation from the colder months wardrobe going into the warmer months wardrobe because this round collar neckline on a jacket is a silhouette I tend to wear a lot. I quite like it for perhaps an evening in summer and it's just an ideal overall piece for when days are a little bit windy. It's a great travel option if you're traveling in summer and you need something for the train, the plane, the boat. Very appropriate for the boat with the little stripes if you want to be a walking cliche, which we all know I love being. And as many of you know, I do live by the beach. That's why I'm a self-proclaimed coastal grandma and I do love a stripe. Are one of those timeless patterns that continue to be modern no matter what time of the year you wear them, no matter what year it is. And I think something like this perfectly blends into the wardrobe I already have. And it's a piece that was missing on my wardrobe. I needed a light jacket for, like I was saying, either summer evenings or when I'm traveling at that kind of has a little bit that silhouette that I tend to wear during the colder months and bring it into the warmer months as well. I do live by the beach so for me stripes are quite an obvious option but I also travel to Paris for work quite often maybe once a week something like that. A piece like this for a Parisian summer evening is just perfect as well or a Parisian day when it gets a little bit chillier. I think the jacket is giving Celine vibes and I am here for it and now for this occasion I paired it with this pair of high-waisted denim trousers. They are really really lovely. I've married it with a little bit of a dark accessory that would go well with the bag I actually took out for lunch today. I got the navy belt, the navy bag, the navy stripes and then for the rest of the outfit it's all kind of toe piece and white colors. The trousers, they are a pair that I was actually missing on my wardrobe at the minute. I needed a pair of white classic, a little bit on the wider leg and denim. These ones are super, super soft to the touch, quite light and really, really stretchy. So perfect for <laughs> lunching with the girls type of day. And something else I really appreciate about them is that there is no pockets in the front. They're not gonna add any sort of extra bulkiness at the front that's normally not needed nor wanted. <laughs> normally when I get a pair of trousers from a new brand, I have to try at least three different sizes. And on this occasion, the size chart that they have up on their website is very, very accurate. We'll leave linked down below what size I actually wear in case you wanna use that as your reference, along with the sizing I wear on everything that I'm showing today. And I feel like this is a seamless addition into my everyday wardrobe. They're both timeless pieces that are going to blend with everything else I have, but also for summer days in Paris, like I was saying, I think it's a very beautiful set to have around. And then if it does get quite hot, I can marry it perhaps with a pair like this one's right here. These shorts are beautifully tailored, not only perfect for lunches and soirees by the beach, but also for the city. They do come in black as well. And I think because they are so sort of wide and tailored and the fabric's quite formal, it is something that I can definitely get away with wearing in Paris on a very hot city day. Now, this is the pair of shorts. I put my hair up in a ponytail because I think really realistically, that is how I would wear it if it was a really hot day. Then if I want to have something for the chilly part of the evening, I can always throw this one of cotton over the shoulders and still feel a little bit put together, not be very hot. I'd probably marry that with something like this for the belt. And then probably I would do my Birkin to go with it. I think that adds an extra bit of warmth to the look itself. And then if I want to keep it a little bit more toned down, I can always go for navies or perhaps taupe accessories. In any case, it's a pair of shorts that will marry with absolutely everything. A black belt with yellow gold accessories or even silver ones would look absolutely gorgeous with it as well. The fabric is a really, really lovely one that's not very prone to wrinkles. So it's also going to be a perfect piece if you want to travel with it and not have to worry that much about steaming pieces upon arrival. I'm a steaming freak. I will steam my stuff every single time before I wear it. Honestly, with fabrics like this one, you're not so super obliged to. It's also got pockets. I think it's a really, really lovely piece that I was missing in my wardrobe. I was missing like a good pair of shorts that would be in very nice quality. I think I'm gonna get myself the black version of them because they're super soft and you can tell that they're not
not see through at all. I'm not wearing white knickers right now and you cannot tell. So this is a good sign. <laughs> but even just like that, if it gets really, really hot, this pair of shorts are just amazing. I feel put together. I feel fresh at the same time. And yeah, really, really like them. Honestly, I need to get this ones in another color. They are the perfect pair of shorts for me. Big tip for those of you that are a little bit larger like myself around this area of your body, pleats that open towards the exterior instead of towards the interior are always going to be more fluttering on our silhouette because it just kind of accompanies the way our silhouette is built. And to be honest with you, I'm trying to completely avoid Paris during the summertime, particularly during August, because, you know, the Olympics, plus all the tourists, plus the heat. It's not really a combination that I want to partake on. However, I do have to sometimes take myself there because of, you know, work events, stuff like that. And if that's the case, I feel like this can be a pair that can easily take me from meetings into more formal-ish evening events and still feel very nice, put together and kind of comfortable and fresh at the same time, to be honest. <laughs> and then if I wouldn't wear this during day time, perhaps not with something that shows so much skin as a cami like this one, I would probably switch things up with a vest like this one right here, which is a kind of thin to medium neat. And it's also got the little golden button detailing in it. I think it's a beautiful piece. The V-neck line is going to elongate the silhouette and it's still got sleeveless details in there that are gonna allow me to keep myself fresh. Okay, so here's the next option. Realistically, I would probably wear this with my garden party, given that every time I go to Paris, I need to take quite a lot of stuff, whether it's for meetings or this is or that. So this is the bag I most likely will carry. But if I'm going to spend a night there or a week there or something, if there's a lot of days of back-to-back -back events, I will probably marry this with something a little bit smaller or perhaps even warmer. And then I can do the Birkin to warm things up a little bit with the tan tones in it and have it marry with the belt as well, which I think adds a little bit of nice warmth to the outfit. I do love knits like this during summertime and in spring as well. I think in wintertime with perhaps a little sheer silky blouse coming from underneath, it can be another piece that um, can instantly transition into the colder months as well. And they can seamlessly blend into my already existing wardrobe. So I don't really need to get other pieces in order to make this one's work with what I already have going on. Just coming up close to to show you once again the little golden button details in there. I think they're absolutely gorgeous. What I love about pieces like this, talking about the beach, is that they are easily transitionable from kind of coastal chic to a little bit more of an urban put together look. And once again, I think stripes are one of those patterns that are going to be timeless. This is definitely going to be a keeper for me. The material of the piece is really, really soft. I get kind of icky with materials that are not soft. So I'm very happy to tell you that the shorts, this, the denim, which I've worn a couple of times since I received it already, same as the jacket. I think some of you spotted it on a vlog. When was it? Two vlogs ago. So I'll link that vlog up here for you where I was wearing the jacket already. Now, something else I didn't mention before is that the shorts will come with their own belt. Um, let me, oops, <laughs> let me show you how this one looks. This will come in quite handy for me because I don't currently have a belt with a silver buckle. Move on to an evening wear sort of attire and I still want to keep myself fresh, I think I would go for a jacket like this one. It's a lot less prone to wrinkling. It kind of like keeps its shape. It's one of those fabrics that just screams a little bit more formality just by looking at it. And the attention to detail on the buttons on this one is absolutely gorgeous. Judging from the sizing on everything, I think their sizing chart is so accurate. So far, everything has been the size that um, I thought it would be according to what I read on their website. So I'm very happy with that, honestly. Let's put on this one and see how it looks. This is absolutely gorgeous. I am obsessed already and I haven't even finished buttoning it up. But it does come with inbuilt shoulder pads so it adds the tiniest bit of structure now those of you with broad shoulders nothing to worry about it's not a very prominent shoulder pad it's actually quite a thin what it's going to do it's going to come design a very slight silhouette at the border of the shoulder and I think that looks absolutely exquisite it speaks about the quality of the garments and their design altogether so this is it completely closed up and worn with the shorts a really lovely marriage absolutely love this for an evening out in Paris. I'd probably go for my 
Kelly Elan handbag if I had it here with me, but I don't. <laughs> Something like this could look really cute for lunch by the beach. A pair of orange sandals to go along and something like that. I could leave the belt, but I think I prefer it towards the outside and not really tucked in. This worn over the shoulders as a jacket would look really, really lovely. It doesn't really add up in warmth. On the contrary, it's a really fresh piece. But also if I want to wear it in a chill type of mood, I can style it with perhaps a dark pair of denim underneath this one over the top silk cami underneath for maybe brunching during the weekend that type of look and Bill is also on the sleeve how beautiful is that I'm obsessed I really really like this one once again we have the round collar neckline which I think is a beautiful ode to some of the biggest style icons if I wanted to take it up a notch I could pair it with the actual skirt that it comes with beautiful matching little buttons in there with the golden detail like look at that I think the skirts alone are a winner for me because this ones are going to be give me the comfort of it being a pair of shorts but then the beauty of it looking like a little skirt my goodness my girlies that are getting married this summer this might be a really really lovely sort of wedding wear type of look vibe piece I mean how gorgeous would this be for either like a rehearsal dinner even a civil wedding or any of those occasions like around the wedding that are perhaps not the main event but hey if you want to wear this to your main event I support you I think it's absolutely stunning I did wear a suit on my wedding day. I'll insert a picture in here in case you girls are curious. Let me bring over my Maison Laurent hat because I think it's going to be the perfect complement. How stunning does it look paired with the hat? I'm obsessed, you girls. This is absolutely gorgeous. Definitely something I would see myself wearing in the south of France or even right here by the beach where we live. After this video, <laughs> I might ask the husband to go get some drinks because I'm feeling cute. I was just taking the picture for the the cover of this look and I showed Tristan really quick. He called it the summer version of the mob wife aesthetic and honestly I couldn't agree more. I have another pair of denim. Kind of a little bit of a more formal touch to it. It's pleated at the front. Doesn't have any sort of hardware whatsoever so it's going to be a little bit more of a formal take on your regular denim but that wasn't the only thing that caught my eye on this piece. It was also the fact that it is oil resistant and so the fabric which is super soft to the touch by the way is in this beautiful kind of white ivory color that's going to have undergone a treatment a little bit less prone to getting stained which for someone like me that is super super clumsy that was like music to my ears or should I say to my eyes because I actually read that oil resistant and I was like I had to scroll upwards again D did I just read oil resistant and yes I, that was correct I was like I need to get that pair because that sounds like something that's going to be perfect in my wardrobe and if they could come up with like a whole oil resistant collection please I would be really really grateful so for the closing mechanism on this one so you're gonna have a little bit of hardware in here and then you close them up right there and then you're gonna bring it right across here and close it up like so a little bit more of a formal wear look which I think is just absolutely gorgeous and then I wanted to pair that with this top it's actually a blazer but I think I would wear this as a top, 100% silk piece. I think I quite enjoy the styling of this one a little bit opened up, showing a tiny bit of the bra underneath. If you're not comfortable with that, you can just do a bralette or perhaps a silk cami top. I think this would be my sort of evening denim trousers, if you know what I mean, because you have that formal closure at the front and then the pleating at the front as well that gives it a little bit of a more formal wear trouser movement without the fabric being actually formal and heavy and then for the top part I've married it with a 100% silk blazer that's got this beautiful motif I don't know how much you can see from far away but perhaps in here you can see a little bit better it's a gorgeous sort of botanical print and then it's got this tying detail I think paired like that that would make for a really lovely sort of evening wear type of look as well during the really warmer months those of you that are regulars on this channel will know that I love sets like this one so so I really cannot wait to try on the pants and see if this will work as a comfy work from home set. If I'm going to edit from home, if I'm going to work from home, if I'm going to even take a plane or whatever and I'm kind of on a business mode type of mood, I need to 
feel that I'm dressing the part. However, I also understand that I'm sometimes laying on the couch just editing YouTube videos or perhaps putting a lookbook together for a client. And having sets like this one, let me put the jacket on, still look really, really cute. So I can work from home all day, feel put together, feel like I'm kind of wearing pajamas without actually wearing pajamas and still look lovely for perhaps going for a drink at the end of the work day or something like that. I also think this makes for a great travel set. This is it from up close and I have to say wearing a silk suit when working from home or even traveling just gives an elegant luxurious touch to my everyday routine that I really appreciate. I love me a matchy matchy movement just like with this one with the skirt. That something like this is definitely up my alley. I love pieces that are not going to give me stuff styling fatigue that if I'm on a day when I'm either in a hurry or I just come back from the gym and need to dive into work and I don't have time to put an outfit together, sets like this one are an absolute go-to for me. Yes, this is the perfect shirt. This is exactly what I've been looking after. It's not really the pants that I would style it with, but let's forget about the pants for a minute. The collar sits so beautifully around the neckline. It sits upwards and that's what I've been looking for in a shirt like this and all of the other ones that I've been purchasing tend to have kind of like nug towards the side whereas this one sits up really really nicely and it's exactly what I've been after with a round collar cashmere for the evening and a darker pair of trousers or even denim will look absolutely gorgeous a little bit of a weekend outing with a tiny touch of extra femininity I love the detailing of the buttons in the sleeve as well and I think this one will be a great addition to my everyday wardrobe with a little bit of a bucolic touch if you ask me Really, really lovely piece right here. Very happy with this one. Now a little bit out of tune with the rest of the pieces, but yet very in tune with the trip I have coming up to Italy very soon. I picked myself this cotton dress in a sort of terracotta color. I can definitely see myself exploring some ancient ruins or, or taking a cafe. I feel absolutely effortlessly chic in this and I think it adds a little bit of that Dolce Vita feel to the vibe of the looks that I'm going for for Italy. It's really really soft to the touch, a beautiful breathable fabric for the warm Italian weather. A little bit of extra styling, doesn't it? Now it feels perfect. Um, so yeah, I can definitely see myself like this now. And perhaps a pair of flat orange sandals. Uh, definitely a beautiful piece that I would feel feminine in and just ready for extra adventures to come. I will have put it on the screen a little bit earlier, but remember my code PIA15 will get you 15% off across all the Goedia website. I think this is a fantastic opportunity. So if you're in a styling phase that like myself, you have some guys in your wardrobe, a little trip coming up, or just staple pieces like the ones I just shared that are going to be perfect for now and five years down the line, I highly advise having a look at them. And then everything I mentioned today plus the sizes will be linked on the description down below for you. Now I think I'm gonna get myself inside of this set in here and get myself to editing a little bit of YouTube before I see you again tomorrow. Good morning everybody. I've just had the best gym session that I've had in a long time. Because I've been a little bit on and off on the plane, on the train, all that jazz, I thought my skin might appreciate something like this. Such a bright sunny day today. After my gym session I had a beautiful walk by the beach. Ooh, this is drenched. I actually really love days like this when I know I'm just gonna spend it at home doing a little bit of admin. I get so swollen when I run at the gym. So this one, for example, that I was wearing on this finger yesterday, it won't fit and it won't fit there for like another hour. I'm gonna have to switch it back later. Also have the Narcissus diamond chain. How beautiful is it? For a little bit of extra sparkle on an everyday basis. Super, super cute. Now for hair, what am I doing? Let's get a little bit of a heat protectant. I love testing out new stuff for hair. So if you have any heat protectants or it can be even like shampoos, conditioner, anything for the hair that you think is absolutely fabulous and I need to try it, please let me know. Today is the 14th of July. My battery actually just died, so I don't know up to where you heard, but I was telling you that we're gonna have fireworks celebration today because it's the 14th of July and this means it's Bastille Day. It's one of my favorite national dates here in France. How beautiful do I look for brunch? Come 
continuing on this sort of self-care type of um, admin day, I'm going to do my leg decompression machine that I haven't done yet since we flew back from Greece. And I'm gonna edit a little bit of YouTube on the meantime. And I think I'm just gonna stay the whole afternoon editing until I take you guys to see the fireworks later.